What's up guys? It's Sadis Mustache and today gonna show you guys the Joel Piercer Bow build. It's finally ready. Do you see this bow right here? That's right, actually now that's the strongest bow in the entire game. It's the Valenos Brace, the Devil Joel 3 bow. Now let me show you guys its features. The Valenos Brace comes with a total attack of 282 with minus 15 percent affinity, 210 dragon elements and high other seal. All this if you have the affinity increase and attack increase augments which I highly recommend for this build right here. Now with all these pieces and skills together we managed to get a total attack of 314 with 0 percent affinity, 210 dragon element and high other seal, which makes this build a very good choice if you want to fight those tempered elder dragons. Now let me show you guys the other pieces that I have in this setup right here. So here we have the Rest Soul Helm Beta. The Kaiser Mayo Beta, the Basil of Embraces Beta, the Nergigantic Oil Beta, the Basil Greaves Alpha, and the Critical Charm 1. Now let me show you guys all the skills that you have together in this setup right here. So here we have Attack Boost Level 4 that increases your attack by 12 points and Affinity by 5%. We have Critical Y Level 3 that increases your Affinity by 10%. We have Critical Boost level 3 that increases the damage dealt by Critical Hits by 40%. We have Critical Door level 3 that increases the affinity by 100% for draw attacks, which is basically everything that we're gonna do in this build. We have Special Ammo Boost level 2 that increases the power of the Dragon Piercer by 20%. We have Bombardier level 2 that increases the power of explosive uh, things by 20%. That will not increase the power of the bow damage, but if you're gonna explode some barrels, that's gonna be helpful. And we have the Piercing Shots level 1 that increase the power of the Dragon Piercer by another 10%. Now let me show you guys the decorations they use in this setup right here. So here we have 2 Attack Jewels 1 that increase the Attack Bull skill. We have 3 Expert Jewels 1 that increase the Critical Lie skill. We have 1 Pierce Jewel 3 that increase the Piercing Shots skill. And we have 1 Critical Jewel 2 that increase the Critical Bull skill. So that's pretty much it guys, I hope you enjoyed, now I'm gonna show you guys uh, a small test here in the training arena so you can actually witness the true power of this build right here. So check this out! So that's pretty much it guys, uh, you can see we are able to hit up to 123 with the Dragon Piercer without any attack boosts available. So if you have an attack boost supplier you can hit even higher than that. And I wanna call attention for a point, in this build right here we don't use the weakness exploit skill. So that means that even if you fail to hit a weak spot you will still hit a critical hit, dealing maximum damage all the time with your shots. So that's pretty much it guys, I hope you enjoyed. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to hit the like button and to subscribe for more Monster Hunter builds like that. So thanks for watching guys and until the next episode, see you!